Hey guys, what's going on? It's Crypto Cine here. Today we're going to talk about Power Ledger and the price prediction of 2018. So, if you're new to Power Ledger, have never heard of it before, or you don't understand what it's for, then I have a pretty good link for you that basically is a crash course for Power Ledger. So, a beginner's guide why it matters, how to buy, and how to store tokens. So, it goes over what is Power Ledger. How does power ecosystem work? What are power and sparks? Because in the ecosystem they have two tokens, the team behind it, the factors affecting the price, how to buy and how to store. So this is a pretty good guide. I will link it in the description. You should definitely check it out. Then we have another thing. So Power Ledger is one of the 15 firms leading the way on the energy blockchain. This is obviously a huge competition. But I think Paul Ledger will do it. So let's go to the price and the analysis. So if we look at Paul Ledger uh, from the start, we can see it started around the 1st or 2nd of November. This is where I think the ICO ended and it's had not much value. So it was around 0 0.05 cents going up to 0 0.16 cents, so triple the market cap in about two weeks. Then we had this huge pump where you saw Power Ledger basically all over the cryptocurrency news and internet, for example, Reddit and other sources, because people realized that Power Ledger is not only another uh, 0815 standard uh, cryptocurrency, but has real potential to change something in the world and how we can affect the nature around us and the uh, environment. So like I said, this was the huge pump from around 20 cents up to uh, 80 cents, so four times the market cap again. And after the pump, we went down from 0 0.18, we had a bit of a resting phase to 0 0.6 dollars and a, a bit of an increase again and then we had this huge resting phase where, it's, um, where the market cap almost got uh, halved. So from 80 cents we went all the way down to resting phase to around 50 cents and we can see that around here so this is the 75 cents and here we have the 50 cents and we stayed there for quite some time and then people um, pumped this coin again but I don't think this is a simple pump and dump again so this is huge whales investing in power ledger because it continued to to release good news and partnerships and the project is really uh, on track right now also with the roadmap so we went all the way from 50 cents to uh, $1.15 in around 5 days so we doubled the market cap then it went up and down like it always does with every cryptocurrency and we had this another pump of $1.24 we can see right here so this was around the 21st of December and then we had this huge uh, Christmas sale basically with every cryptocurrency where the Bitcoin went went from 19k all the way down to almost 11 12k and that's why this price uh, decreased so hard but that that's with every cryptocurrency and right now we're on the way back up to uh, next goal probably around $1.50 and I think we can see this in January 2018 $1.50 will be probably inevitable. So if we want the price of $10 we would uh, basically need the market cap multiplied by 10 because right now it's around $1 so we would need Three, let's round it to 3.6 billion dollar market cap. Now, if you look at the other cryptocurrencies and where 3.6 billion would place us, this would be uh, the 15th place. 
Now, if you think about it, the top 10 cryptocurrencies, which cryptocurrencies in the top 10 really have such game changing uh, use cases like Power Ledger? Well, Bitcoin doesn't. Ethereum has in the cryptocurrency space, but not in the real world. Bitcoin Cash doesn't. Ripple has. Litecoin doesn't. Cardano doesn't. Dash and NEM probably not. So, right now, in the top 15, in the top 20, top 10, we don't have that many cryptocurrencies that have real use case and real world applications, but are there for the cryptocurrency. But I definitely can see uh, Power Ledger going to 3.6 billion market cap, placing us at 15. Um, in 2018, then we would be around ten dollars. Well, the problem is we have a circulating supply of 366, 356 million right now, but the total supply is one billion. So I'm not that familiar with Ledger and how much it, it, the circulating supply increases increases per year. But well, if the total supply gets uh so if the circulating supply in 2018 is equal to the total supply we would need a market cap of 10 billion well 10 billion would place us at the ninth place and i definitely think we could see this if paul Ledger continues to uh, stay focused and deliver new partnerships and get known to the world so with this circulating supply, I think it's inevitable that we won't see Power Ledger at $10. I think it will definitely happen in 2018. With the total supply, I could also see it happen. If you quickly go over the website, we can see in the ICO it raised 34 million Australian dollars, which, which is, I think, the uh, biggest Australian startup in this year. So this really tells us that it has some potential. If you scroll down, we have white paper in English, Hindi, French, Korean, Arabic, and Chinese. And right now they are translating it to other languages as well. So this is a really important uh, thing to do so we can spread the word out there and everyone understands what Power Ledger could be possible or could be capable of doing. So they also have um, a snapshot of Power Ledger and a token paper, token interaction, main sale announcement. They have really a lot of documents you can read through to fully understand um, Power Ledger. Then you have the Power Ledger applications where you can see for what Power Ledger could be used. Then you have the different layers. Then you have an important thing which is the timeline. So right now they don't really have um, that much like pro, um, projects in the timeline, but they want to expand the company to different uh, countries and they want to get working, for example, in Europe and America. So right now, Power Ledger is already in use, but I think only in Australia, but they recently partnered with India as well. So down there, we can see the partners. Currently, a lot of partners, as we can see, and it will be getting more and more in 2018. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you now have full trust in Power Ledger in 2018. Leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe. Thanks for watching.